We are the Falco family. Brian, Serena, Cameron, Kendall, and Savannah. We're a family of five driven by purpose and fueled by love. We decided to trade in the traditional school life for a life where every day is an adventure of faith and love. From a small photography business grew a love of memory keeping and filmmaking that turned into a full blown dream of becoming a family of filmmakers exploring the truth about education. So we're learning to document our adventures in homeschool, business, and life and tell stories of how we live and what we learn. We are in Williamsburg, Virginia. A little bit of a family vacation, friends. And we're getting ready to head to Colonial Williamsburg to walk around, see the sights, learn some things, and we thought we would take you along with us. So I'm actually filming on my new camera. I've been um, procrastinating on using this camera for like ever. I'm gonna vlog the day in Colonial Williamsburg, and I'm gonna use my new camera and see how it goes. Trying to figure out where the buttons are, trying to um, customize all the settings it's just it's doing the most but you guys are gonna be with me as I try to figure it out come over here if you want to be seen <laughs> Cameron doesn't like my shirt he says the face looks a little strange and it's my you said the beauty marks a little much <laughs> this globe so gorgeous Looking super cute today. She's got on a little butterfly necklace. Let me see your butterfly earrings. She's got her on cute little butterfly earrings. A little accessory in her hair. She's enjoying the weather. <laughs> okay, they followed me, so. First of all, can we talk about how stylish Savannah is right now? <laughs> Sparkle bag. Where her pee? <laughs> hey, mama. Get it, girl. We're at the visitor center. We're heading to the shuttle. So at the front of the visitor center, there is a really neat stone map display of Bloomingdale Williamsburg. <laughs> about a 10-15 minute walk if you walk over the pedestrian bridge or you can take the shuttle. So I have a lot of family members that live in Virginia and I wish we could go and hang out and see them right now but um, looks like that's not going to be a part of the plan. Well, that's okay. Vanna, where are you? Where's Michael? I'm an explorer, not a She's Vanna the Explorer. What are you doing, girl? So I live for moments like these moments when you meet someone who makes your experience that much brighter. I wish I had grabbed his name. I wish I had given him our card, but I'm just grateful that our paths crossed either way.
we wanted to ride the horse and carriage, but the they run by appointment. So every time you see guides in costume, or if you see a house with a flag, those are the spots where they conduct the tours. Um, so you can walk around without a um, ticket, but if you want to go into the tours, you need to purchase a ticket. I feel like all of the pictures and videos that I've seen really haven't done it justice. It's massive. It's very large. It's a very large, very open town square type of space. History is such an interesting thing. And one of the guides, um, while we were walking through the grounds, and he really gave us really wonderful information, which I was really hoping for. Um, just giving us some context as to what it was actually like during the time period. It didn't look uh, like it looks now, that a majority of the people walking around in the town were actually enslaved. African American. This little spot, so nice. <laughs> so nice and cool. I know I love a good moss. But yeah, it was just really nice to have that context there. The biggest takeaway was that it was a lot bigger than what I expected. like the king of relaxation um, we got back a little bit ago and uh, we made lunch the kids have been hanging out they watched the karate kid and now I'm just really chilling like that let's see if I can back up back up um, so yeah pass that out of the place? it looks like it. it definitely looks like it so yeah we've just been relaxing which is definitely me if it doesn't let's just write the lines on it why are you in my face? To go back through our website. I've been working on it quite a lot. Um, I'm basically moving our Patreon space, um, our Patreon Friends Club space over to our website. I actually have had a blog for many years. Like, I have a lot of blog posts that I just never published. Um, I have been using my blog as a journal for years and um, I am somewhat of a private person. I know that I'm in these internet streets and everything, but I'm very, very careful in particular about the things that I choose to share. And um, now I'm trying to loosen up just a little bit, not a lot, just a, <laughs> just a little. So I wanted to go back through um, old archive blog posts that were never published and um, just kind of like update them. And I thought it would be a good exercise for me to go back through this journal of mine just to see how far we've come. And um, I thought it would just be good for um, for our website and our blog to be able to actually press publish on a lot of these posts. So I'm going to be doing that. I'm just going to take it like a little bit at a time. I'm one of those people that would really, really like to be able to have something done completely and then launch but uh that's clearly not the way my life works <laughs> it, it clearly just it just doesn't work for my life right now um so i'm just going to take my time working through it um in both of the spaces in the patreon space i'm going to try to catch up the last two years of having the patreon space and um on our blog on our website which is on our website, which is the Falco family.com. So, so, I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of thoughts and feelings to this post and see if we can get it published. I just want that to be our home where we can keep our journal, keep our videos, um, 
uh, manage our friends club um, and all the other things that we'll have going on. What's <laughs> up? So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to get in my 15, 20 minutes of updating and pressing publish on a blog post that I should have done um, several years ago. So. Don't, Don't forget, forget to subscribe! subscribe.